than leave dishes for the reader. I prevent having dishes to wash by not cooking. <laughs> I eat nuts and cheese and berries. <laughs> but what if I did not eat? A while ago, my boyfriend left me. Bella says it's sexy that I go around my small circle in town saying, he broke up with me, he left me, he quit. Sexy, but I don't know how not to. He didn't leave, and he wasn't my boyfriend. He was my fiance. He stays in, deep in, a granite fissure in Manhattan. I stay in Minnesota and go out. I go out to meet the girls, old girls, new. We go on, trifling with language that's in use for us, hot, cool, loving women with not cool, loving husbands, or with hot, cool, loving boyfriend, or with no husband or boyfriend. Duende, for a season. Smile when you read Brave New World. A sort of smirk. Like you're getting away with reading literature that was once banned. Like this is better than Japanese ever was. Except one time that you dreamed that Yoko Ono walked all over your back and ass. <laughs> this doesn't come close to that. Two, you took up whistling. Jingles from television commercials, Samsonite, Sony, tampon, and yogurt ads. It was almost as bad as my ex, Tony, who whistled, if I only had a brain, until I accidentally called him a moron. <laughs> Three. One morning I woke up thinking, I can't remember the last time you used the L word. And then, I can't remember the last time you went down on me. Then I recall they used to be linked together. Ah. <laughs> Four. It is Camellia White. We tub the baby, but it does not drown. We harness the baby, call it Redbone. We bound its tiny hands until they are changed to blue flax, until they disappear. When the baby cries all night, we place it in the dresser drawer. We count coins shaped like animals, moons like trees. It comes near the wainscot, near tresses. It is wild, wild, wild. We give the baby wings, smooth its plumage, feet its sky and kumquats. The baby hangs from a chain and rope. We sing and sob and pray near rivers, streams, and lakes. Near lemon trees, we try to feed it lemons. Fill its cheeks with little black horses and wait for them to gallop out. We call it wildflower. We call it luck. We, we read eulogies above the wicked baby. We tuck scented geraniums behind its ears, its red-hot tongue. It is undeserving, yet we know it is glorious. The baby hushes and we whistle. We take the baby to a humdinger. We let it play with elephants, soak it in lavender oil. It's like sewing a rip in your jeans with garter snakes instead of thread. It's like watching a Russian film with the ghost of Ronald Reagan. <laughs> It's like squeezing three bean salad out of a toothpaste tube. It's like driving from Detroit to Denver in a cardboard car. It's like swimming in Maalox. It's like eating drywall. It's like, it's like, it's like drawing with cesium. It's like interviewing a neutrino. It's like French kissing a shaman. It's like reading Mom Flanders in Urdu. It's like changing a colostomy bag on a Berkshire pig. It's like digging a tunnel to Trenton with your mother's tongue. <laughs>